Cornish pasty. Look at this, if you're just joining. You may not have seen me making my own handmade Cornish pasty. And I made the pastry. Look at that. Maybe it tastes better when it's cold. Yeah, not bad. My main problem is the filling doesn't really seem like it should go in here. It's more like a char siu bao filling. Yeah, I like it. Oh my god. Yeah, the pastry, pastry is really good. It's just a filling. It's a bit weird. You really need some beef. Beef and carrots. Not this minced pork. Mm. The best bit is the edge. It's like crunchy and crispy. Wow, that's the best thing I ever made. Damn, look at that pastry. That's proper pastry. <coughs> <coughs> the other bowl, there's no other bowl. There's a frying pan, it's got the filling left over. Look at that pastry. Look at the flakiness. This is so much different to my apple pie. Oh my god. It breaks apart in your mouth. It doesn't it's not like chewy biscuit. Let me check the other one. I think this is the best thing I've ever made. I didn't think making pastry dough would be this fun. Um. Hmm. I'm kind of full up already. I think I'm just going to eat half. Because I ate the filling, the leftover filling. I'm worried that I'll cook it, and then when my girlfriend comes home, she's going to have to eat it cold. Because if I put it in the microwave... Oh wait, I can reheat it in the air fryer, can't I? So it'll go soggy in the microwave. Looks like uncooked meat. No, it can't be. I boiled it for like half an hour. And then it cooks for another 30 minutes in the air fryer. Oh my god. It's so good. Oh, I should have put some leeks in it.
spring onion. So it seems like the trick to make uh, flaky pastry was use cold hard butter, don't squish the butter into the flour until it disintegrates. It's going to have like lumps of butter in it. And then go use ice cold water and fold it a few times but don't over squish it. I really, when I made the apple pie, I squished the pastry as much as I could until there was no visible butter and it just came out like a biscuit <laughs> it was like that hard hard brittle biscuit mm. this would be good with like a creamy sauce as well But it's very, it's like very rich, very filling. I think because of all the butter. It's not exactly a light snack. Uh oh. The base has broken. I'll give my girlfriend the, the new one that's cooking now. But I don't I really don't think she's gonna eat much of it. She'll take a few bites and say, Oh wow, it's amazing. And then she'll just go back to eating her own Thai food. She always does that. She'll take a few bites of what I made and then she'll just go back to her shrimp noodles or whatever. I don't think she could even finish this. It's very filling. 